If you'd like to set up a new or additional Outlook account, it's really very easy. You can use Outlook as your local email client if you have an email account through your internet service provider or a webmail service. This will allow you to receive email through Outlook rather than these other services. Before you begin, you'll need to know your email address, username, and password, and the incoming and outgoing mail server information. You'll need to get this information from your ISP or email provider. Once you have that information, you can begin. If this is your first Outlook account, the wizard will start automatically when you open Outlook. Since I already have one Outlook email account, I need to select Tools, Email Accounts from the main menu. This launches the Email Accounts Wizard. The Email Accounts Wizard will walk me through the necessary steps to set up my account. I'm going to click Add a New Email Account and choose Next. Next, I need to choose the server type. Most ISPs and webmail services use POP3 servers. Some providers, such as AOL, use IMAP. Regardless of which choice you make here, the following wizard screens will be the same. My email server uses POP3, so I'll choose that and click Next. Now I need to type in my name and my email address. And I also need my incoming mail server and my outgoing mail server. Remember, this is the information that you got from your ISP or web mail service. Finally, I need to put in the username and the password for my current email account. Once you've put in all of this information, Microsoft suggests that you click Test Account Settings. When you click this button, the wizard will look at everything you've entered. If there's a problem, it will flag you and you can correct the mistakes. For now, let's click Next. The wizard lets you know that you've entered the information successfully. Click Finish. Now, whenever you launch Outlook, you'll be able to receive the email that's come to you through your internet service provider or webmail service.